ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Welcome back to Fantasy Live. Last time we made it here to the Elderwood Village and today we are going to go into Pino's house here. He's the only one with a house in the Elderwood Village. And we're going to talk to him and hopefully convince him that I see the Great Spirit. Oh, oh, good, uh, oh good, you're ready to leave. Uh, just a little bit longer. Fine, I shall continue to wait. Okay, that was not the right thing to click on apparently. We're ready to leave. Oh good, you're ready to leave. Yeah, we're ready to leave and then I shall escort you to the exit. Thank you, that's very kind of you. I leave straight away. I will tell no one of this place because you're all unwelcoming. Mm hmm. Wait, what? What happened? There, you should be able to pass. I truly am grateful to you for rescuing my little sister. Well, safe travels. Excuse me. There's something I'd like to ask you first. Has has a Castellian lady ever passed through here? A Castellian lady? Well, we do get the odd lost human wandering across our borders, but. Come to think of it, I remember Hoom and Lady being allowed to visit when I was little, back when there were many other children of the forest before they all went away. Actually, Blue Cap, you remind me a little of that lady. I knew it, Mother's been here. Oh, what's wrong, Flutter? Mr. Pino, please read this. We were told to give this letter to the children of the forest. A letter, but from whom? From Ophelia, the Queen of Castell. Handed over Ophelia's letter, do we get to read it again? No, from Mother? Lady Ophelia? Hmm, I dare say this letter is intended for the Great Spirit herself. Very well, I shall personally deliver it to the Great Spirit. And, uh, incidentally, the name of the Lady Ophelia is not unknown to me. I... you mean... That's the Spirit. Pino, Pino, what's wrong? Layla, Layla collapsed. What? Ooh... She fell over. What is this? Pino, what's wrong with Layla? Layla's gonna die? <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen anyone with a condition like this before. What could be the cause of this? Maybe it's the effects of the Doomstone. What are you talking about? Doomstones have the power to possess nearby monsters and make them violent. And Layla was bitten earlier by a pair of those shadow monsters. Maybe the monsters transferred their condition to her through their bite. My sister and I are half human, half monster. It's not impossible that we could contract a monster's condition. How can I save my sister? Forest medicine won't cure this. I can try to help her. You can help her? How? Have you got some special medicine? I can use my power to hold back the doom, uh, Doomstone's effect. Everyone, stand back! Interesting. What? What is that? You were what? You're the girl from Mount Snow Peak. Is that the girl? Oh, yes, it is. It's her hat. I wonder what was on her head. And I was just like, what? Dale? Laura? Please forgive me. My true name is Yulia. I wanted to say something. I really did. I'll try to explain later. I have to help Layla right now. Look, the shadowy parts are spreading fast. I'm going to use my power to hold off the effects of the, of the stone temporarily. Dale, Laura, you have to find a doomstone before it's too late. Okay, got it. Let's go, Dale. Uh, can you really save my sister? I think so. No, I know we can, but we need to destroy that doomstone. I understand. I shall guide you through the forest. Please come with me. Pino joined our party. Yay, Pino. It sounds like a wine. <laughs> uh, a Pino wine. Okay, it's so over here. Yep. And back through we go. Time to find the Doomstone. Alright. So back through to the Elderwood Forest. Or the Deep Elderwood even. Okay, let's go find that Doomstone. Although, are there going to be monsters now? Oh yes there are, there's some monsters here. Here we go. Bro, there's a strange aura coming from up ahead. Yes, I feel it. I can't stop shaking. This whole place is off limits. If the Doomstone has fell around here, I bet no one's found it yet. Bro, why you gotta do everything she says? Bro, don't tell me you're thinking she's pretty, do you? Yes, very pretty. Very, very pretty. You're talking a little funny again, bro. It's creeping me out. Rah! Ah, what? What was I saying? And you're back to normal again. Her personality may not be up to much, but she's certainly easily on the eyes. No, no, what am I saying? That's hardly ever relevant to the current... That's hardly relevant to the current situation. You two again? Oh, uh... What a coincidence. Seems like we just keep running into each other. I don't believe it, but I'm actually glad to see you. It's my bro. He's acting all possessed again. We're not doing anything wrong, I swear it. <laughs> see? Rah. Huh? What are you two uh, doing prowling around here? You don't know us, man. Don't accuse us of prowling. We're searching. You stupid squash head. Just keep quiet. You took your sweet time. Oh, it's Noelia. So we've got Yulia and Noelia. Uh, hmm. Did you get what I asked for? Uh, well, it's not as easy as that. Not like we didn't try. Please, just give us a little longer. We endeavor to serve. Bro, you're a slave now? <laughs> Silence, turn up head. I ain't anyone's slave. <laughs> oh, it's you. So we meet again. What's, uh, where's Goody Two-Shoes? Not with you today? So we got N Yulia and Noelia. Hmm, someone's been affected by the Doomstone, and Yulia's using her powers to stop the spread. Pfft, always a little savior. Still, from what you say, saving her might not be as simple as destroying the Doomstone. What? But why not? 
It's not like when the shadowy monsters are affected by this Doomstone's influence externally. This girl's been bitten by a monster, right? That means the Doomstone's power has directly entered her bloodstream. Breaking the Doomstone won't help her if its evil is already inside her body. No! So what can we do? Hey, you, Dale or whatever you're called. I'll help you out, just because this is an interesting case. Get rid of the shadowy monsters and bring me the Doomstone shards. I should be able to make a potion to restore the girl back to normal. Your goons help too. What? Us? I'll need some other materials to synthesize the potion. Go and get those. But these are... Yep, mushrooms. Right up your alley. <laughs> Quit your belly aching and get a move on. Bro, this seems too dangerous. I agree, Butch. But for some reason, whenever I hear that voice, I must obey. What? He is so whipped. Yes, mistress, your wish is my command. Mistress. Bro! And Chompy's just like, Chompy, Chompy, bro. Heh <laughs> Good doggy. Do as you're told. You should make haste. It looks like this particular doomstone is ex especially potent. Good luck. I'll meet you by the village entrance when you're done. And you turn back into a black butterfly. I want to know what they're... Obviously, they're sisters, but... Oh, she just turned into a butterfly as well. Girls can turn into butterflies. Could that mean they're both the goddesses? The goddesses what? No, never mind. Ignore me. Let's just do what this... Uh, do what she says and do it quickly. Otherwise, my poor sister will... Yes. First, we need to get to that doomstone, Dale. And Doomstone's over this way. Okay, let's go find it. Luckily there's no mon- Oh, hang on, there's a monster roaming around. <laughs> it's like, luckily there's no monsters roaming around. Oh wait, there's a shadow monster there, and it's attacking my bounty box of a monster I killed. Ah, here we are. Lots of things. There! Oh, this looks easy. Easy peasy. So many shadow monsters all in one place. Is the big one in the middle, uh, the shadow monster boss? This can only mean one thing. Over there, the Doomstone. Look, Dale. Watch out, YouTube. I'm going in. Alright, let's just take out the, the monsters. And there we go. Double spin attack. Oh, pfft. So easy. <laughs> it's just like... Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. And dead. That was... Oh my goodness, that was so easy. Oh, hang on, what's this? Interesting little building type thing. That was quite a large doomstone, actually. Ha uh ha, -huh. so this is the doomstone, or what's left of it. It's the biggest one I've seen yet. I guess it's just as she said. Reveria really is going to... No, now's not the time. Dale, Pino, let's get this and go quickly. Please, hold on, Leela. Okay, here we go again. Look, it's... we must make haste. I shall dash and get stuck on a fence. <laughs> My bounty box is still here. i still got full health, I think, which is interesting, considering that shad shadow monster was attacking it. Shadow wolf or coyote or whatever it was. Right. Oh, it's Yoelia. Yulia? No, Noelia. Hmm, you bought the Doomstone Shards. Good. Can you use them to save Leela? Yeah, no prob. Oh, look, my little doggies have returned. Hey, what's up, bro? <laughs> that that was a close call. This is what you needed, isn't it? Good. All right, you're off the hook, ugly. Really? Bro, what does she mean? No, nothing. Forget it. <laughs> All right, as promised then. I've got everything we need, so take me to the girl. Why are we letting her in here? She's obviously not good. I can't even remember the last time we saw her. It was at the, um, the, the temple with a... Um, Damon, wasn't it? Pino, Pino, later still sick. Dale, did you manage to destroy the Doomstone? I have these shards right here. Noelia, what are you doing here? <laughs> he asked me to help. Yeah, we did. Okay, looks like I was right. Simply smashing the Doomstone did not cure her. Give me a moment. Uh, mix, mix, mix. Bang, bang, bang. Sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. Twinkle, twinkle, twinkle. Doomstone's gone. <laughs> Alright, it's prepared. Use this on the girl. Go ahead. Go ahead. Thank you. I'll give it a try. Magically better! Woo! Later gonna be okay, uh huh. Look, the shadows are fading away. Ooh, pretty. Okay, Leela getting better. Leela saved. <laughs> oh, Leela, you're gonna be okay. Dale, no payment necessary this time. I'd feel bad when you look so happy. Noelia, what did I just hear you say to Dale? No big deal. Forget it. I didn't say anything. But you've been so devious about trying to get your hands on doomstones. No, I'm not doing that anymore. I think I know where I can find what I was really looking for. I'm gonna get going. Mistress, where are you going? What is your next command? Bro is still possessed. Oh, I forgot. I was supposed to unenchant you. And there. Uh? What? What happened to me? Bro, are you back to normal for real this time? Noelia, you scamp. <laughs> I've told you before. It's wrong to manipulate people. What's the big deal? Who cares if I make use of some no-good lazy layabout who doesn't even have a life? Besides, maybe I should introduce a new life. The puppeteer life. My gift to Reveria. Like you ever did anything that wasn't 99% selfish. You're such a do-gooder. Quit meddling in other people's affairs and focus on your own responsibilities for once. We don't have much time left, you know. Hmm, interesting. I'm gone, Dale. It's been real. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's so bizarre. Noelia. Oh, 
What's wrong, bro? I can't remember anything. What did I do? I was picking mushrooms in the forest like usual. Then I met that girl. Then she started to entice me. I, I mean, she spoke to me, and I came over all funny. Bro, I'm going to speak my mind for once. You're a real sap when it comes to women. Get a grip and quit acting like a love-struck puppy. Yes, Butch, you're right. My eyes have been opened. From this day forth, I pledge never again to lose my mind over a girl. Bro, I'm so glad. Oh, Layla's fine. That's fantastic. It's like we're all having a fun party. Layla, Papino? Oh my, what's going on? Layla is better. Layla is saved. Look, bro, ain't that great? The girl is all better again. Everybody, thank you so much. My lady, the pleasure was all mine. There's no need to, uh, for you to thank me. For you, I would pick every mushroom in the forest and present them to you as a token of my devotion. Um, who are you? Bro, what happened to your pledge? Be quiet. I do not need to explain my love to you. Sister of mine, you caused me nothing but worry. I'm sorry, Pino. Thanks. Uh, thank you for saving me. I'm glad you're okay, Lula. It's so nice to have a sibling. It's like you've always got a friend. <laughs> oh, please don't cry. You were such a big help today. Flutter. I mean, Yulia, wasn't it? That's right. I'm so glad everything turned out okay. Aren't you, Dale? Uh, Laura left our party. Where is Laura, actually? She's behind us. Pino left our party. Is Yulia going to turn back into a butterfly? Oh, hang on. There's more. There's more stuff to do. Talk to Yulia. Oh, she's over here. Hi. Uh, I'm sorry for not telling you the truth. I didn't want to deceive everyone. I have wanted to tell you the truth for so long, but I was scared you wouldn't believe me. Will, will you forgive me? Yeah, all right. Then. So, oh, Dale. Of course you would. Uh, of course we would have believed you, Yulia. Oh, it's Laura. Okay, I was confused. You silly thing. Don't. Uh, I don't care if you're not who you said you were. You're still you. You're still the same butterfly, a uh, girl who came adventuring with us, right, Dale? But but I lied to your faces so many times. Maybe, but I'm sure you had your reasons. We know you're a good-hearted little fly. Oh, Laura, come here, silly. Now I can wipe your tears. Do you have any idea how hard it is to wipe a butterfly's tears? Oh, that's so strange. Hehe, <laughs> thank you. Noelia is my sister, did you guess? She acts like a horrible brat, but she's not a bad person inside. I think that she and I are both looking for the same thing. A way to save Reveria using the power of wishes. The power of wishes, huh? Yes, a way to save Reveria from the doom which is ever approaching. Father said these words to us. To save this world from destruction, you must use the power of wishes, a power that has all but gone from Reveria. Apparently there is a connection between the power of wishes and each life in this world. So Noelia and I both came to Reveria to find that power. But we ended up getting separated on the way. You came to Reveria? But from where? From someplace far away. Dale, Yulia, Laura. Oh, it's Pino. Hi. Could you come here for a moment? The Great Spirit has spoken. She wishes to meet you. Really? But you said we were unproven. Yes, well, the Great Spirit, she read your letter, you see, and she has decided to deem you all proven. The Forest Dwellers have a special agreement with certain members of the Royal Family of Castell. According to the Great Spirit, you, Laura, are none other than the rightful heir to the throne. That's true. <laughs> well, there we go. The Great Spirit waits within. When you are ready, please make your way to her. Interesting. Dale, let's go with Laura too. Oh, you know, let's just let's just go with Laura. You know, she's the one that's proven and allowed to go in because she's part of the royal family. But let's let's tag along. <laughs> anyway, we will be tagging along next time because we have finished this episode, guys. Thank you all very much for watching. And of course, next time we are going to go talk to the Great Spirit herself here in the Elderwood Village. So thanks once again, and I of course will see you all in the next episode.